House committee members continue their calls for District Attorney Larry Krasner's impeachment, all while supporters rallied for him just steps away. Jeff, you were there for today's hearings, and you heard both sides. Here at both sides, busy day here at the Navy Yard. Now listen, the focus of this hearing was clearly on Philadelphia's DA, Larry Krasner, but some of the victims of crime who testified today really raised issues about Philadelphia police, judges, even bail commissioners. If we don't get it, shut it down. Across the street from the hearing room, supporters of DA Larry Krasner attacked the gathering and the Pennsylvania House members holding it. When fascists try to steal our democracy, what do we do? Stand up, fight back! And there are some days that I need to go to where he is resting. Inside, the Select Committee on Restoring Law and Order heard from the victims of crime. Nikisha Billa, whose son Dominic was slain in the Philadelphia Mills Mall last year, wants to leave the city. I went out. I don't feel safe. The trauma of losing Dom on a regular day. Committee members say their focus is rising crime in Philly, its causes, solutions, and public funding to stop it. But critics argue their true goal is to impeach the city's twice-elected DA, claiming he's soft on crime. Critics argue your mandate is to impeach Krasner. Yeah, well, what I would say is, is that we will take a look at everything that's in House Resolution 216. I absolutely believe he needs to be impeached. He has been misbehaving in office. He doesn't even comply with our own laws. Krasner has sued the panel and accused it of playing dirty politics while it convinced the Pennsylvania House to hold him in contempt. Testifying on video, Jennifer Molesky, who wept as she spoke of the unsolved killing of her son, Chucky Maud. When he died, I died. I know that I try every day for my grandkids and my other kids, but oh, you have no idea what it's like. On the phone, Molesky tells Fox 29 she's frustrated at the entire system. Others argued Krasner's new prosecutors are lost, not doing their jobs. Malika Womack complaining of low bail amounts allowing the accused to go free, lost her daughter to a stabbing. Where is the justice in it? I can't see my daughter again. I got to live with this every single day. It hurts. It's a struggle to get out of bed. Emotional testimony today, but certainly these issues are deeply complicated. D.A. Krasner would like to testify in front of this panel. The chairperson of the committee says they, Jay, mess, they may just give him a chance. Live here in the Navy Yard in Philly, Jeff Cole, Fox 29 News. Folks. All right, Jeff, thank you. A